Apple HomeKit users, have you ever had the problem of adding someone to your Apple Home? They just would not get the invitation. They never got the notification. I had that problem adding my son, or actually both of my sons, to our Apple Home. And I'm gonna share with you how we were able to fix that. My name is Jonas Troyer. Make sure you uh, check out the rest of our channel. We're going to have more Apple HomeKit videos coming. This is officially our first one about Apple HomeKit, but we actually build our own Barn Dominion by ourselves, all solar powered off grid and Apple HomeKit smart home. So anyway, we had this problem. Um, I could not, my son got a, a 15 year old son got an iPhone uh, here a couple months ago and I was trying to add him and I actually had two different Apple support personnel help me and we couldn't figure it out. They finally, I think they finally gave up. They hung up on me on the phone call and the person I was texting through Apple support text, they, they told me that I need to contact a senior rep because they can't figure it out. We checked software updates, made sure everybody was on the same uh, software version. Uh, we checked for uh, software updates on our accessories in our, our barn dough. All of that was fine. And we canceled invitations and resend them probably 20 times. And it just never, the, my son just never received the notification. And then my second son got an Apple Watch. He's not old enough to have a phone yet, but he, we got him an Apple Watch and he wanted to be a part of the, uh, the home as well. And I wanted to add him and we got the same story there. Software updates were all up to date and he never got the notification. Finally, I got an email yesterday from our local Apple store. I have a business account with them and I asked him for help. He sent me an article and asked if we did all of this stuff and I checked it and we had tried all of that before. And then my son, Joe, I had the idea. He's like, dad, when I created my, my iCloud account, it told me to be careful not to put a space behind the email. I guess that was maybe when he signed into his iCloud. He's like, try that once. So, like, okay. So I typed out his email before when I went to invite him, I started typing and his contact would pop up with his iCloud email attached to it. And I would click on it and send the invitation. He never received it. So this time I typed out the email and put a space behind the email and hit send notification. Immediately he got it. I did the same for my son with the watch, Lewis, and instantly he got the notification as well. So if you have the same problem, try putting a space behind the iCloud email and see if that works because that's what worked for us. Nowhere could I find anywhere in documentation from Apple how to do that, but that is what worked for us and hopefully this is kind of a workaround until Apple fixes that. So make sure you share this video, leave a comment down below if you've had problems with this and subscribe because we're gonna have a lot more Apple HomeKit videos coming and we'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching.